text we goes to the masters of the product creation and now we are giving the name of the product that is computer and now we can give here the group whether it's primary so I'm giving the unit as number and the brand as Apple or whatever the brand of the computer and now we here you can give in the model number if it's there and you can select the model number out there or if there is not there you can add it here I'm giving the model number as model and if any narration to be given you can give it out there and save it and uh, here I'm giving the size and size is not given we can give it out there whether it's large medium or small and if any narration if it can be given and save and next I can go to the MRP amount that I can fill it manually and next I can fill the purchase rate and next the sales rate next if any tax is to be added you can give the tax and if it's not applicable I can give not applicable and next I can go to the uh, that is BOM that is bill of materials if any bill of materials uh, that means that are any uh, what are the uh, what are the things which is used to purchase a computer that I'm giving here the raw materials firstly I'm giving the keyboard and I'm filling its quantity and its number and next mouse is given as the raw material and its quantity and its unit and next if I want I can give another raw material that is mobile and its quantity and its unit and one by one if the raw materials is to be added you can give accordingly and if anything is to be deleted you can delete and if it to be saved you can save it successfully and next you can fill the minimum stock maximum stock and the reorder level these three are filled according manually according to the needs and next is given as the go down you can select the go down and the specific rack can be given and if the batch is uh, there you can give the batch number and multiple unit can be selected and next we goes to the opening stock and if the opening stock is there you can give the yes menu and you can fill the details whether which is the go down which is the rack and batch accordingly yeah here I give, gave the yes option and uh, I selected the go down and the rack 1 or uh, 2 is selected and the batch number is selected yeah and the manufacturing date you can give which is the date and which is the expiring date here I'm filling according manually which is my expiring date and the quantity can be given and next uh, here I give the rate of the product and I can select the unit and you can see the if I select the unit you can see the maximum amount out there and accordingly you can give the next option of the same thing that I can selecting this according to the same as I told before you can give the go down rack batch and the manufacturing expiring date quantity rate and I gave the unit and uh, if you want any uh, alteration you can delete that row so it's successfully deleted and finally you can save it so that's what all about the product creation and next uh, the masters I just can go to the product register that is I am registering the already created product so here I'm selecting the group of the product that is the product group is selected all so there I can see all the products and selected already created product that is computer you can see that out here and I'm edit editing the computer's name that is I'm giving according to my name and I'm updating that and that is updated successfully okay and these are the products that has already been saved and here I'm giving the uh, searching the product as primary or accordingly and according to the name also you can search that is a search option and according to the size uh, whether it's large or small